Lately, I've been looking for a new style of tactical shooter to grip me like my long-term love Escape from Tarkov did, and finally, I found one. A really good one. Let me introduce you to my new side thing, Zero Hour. A new tactical shooter that pairs 5v5 hostage rescue slash bomb defusal gameplay from games of old like Counter-Strike with beautiful graphics, in-depth movement and an interesting weapon customization and purchasing system, Zero Hour really does have everything in place to become a great tactical shooter and boy I am hooked. Let's first talk about movement briefly. Your character feels so slow like his gear is really weighing them down and you can't even sprint for more than a few seconds without getting tired and personally I think that's great. Especially in maps that require you to be slow and methodical either by clearing rooms or sneaking around the enemy. The lack of stamina when sprinting really requires you to think about where you are positioned and where your teammates are around you because if you sprint aimlessly, you're gonna get slapped. It's not just the clunky and heavy feel of your character though, you've got the basic leaning and you've got your scroll wheel where you can control your movement speed whether that be by walking, crouching or crawling and the police boys, well they can even repel up the side of buildings and breach through windows which is insanely cool to look at. The weapon and equipment system in this game is also unique and like I said something I've never seen before in a game like this. It's got a vast weapon modding system which you're able to do at the start of each round within a game or if you have a standard weapon build that you love to use consistently, you can also do it in the menu before loading into a game itself. But you also on top of this have to remember how many weapons there are in stock before picking your weapon at the start of each round. Your attachments are free but your weapons they only have a limited amount of stock and that goes for across the whole team. If you survive a round you get to keep your weapon, but if you die, that weapon is lost from your team's equipment pool selection for the rest of the game. Zero Hour, I'm not gonna lie, it's a challenge too. There's of course a training mode, but playing against other players is a whole different ball game. You die insanely quickly, and when you first start out you're gonna be dying a lot. Not to mention each map has a breaker box on the map which allows you to cut the power so everything gets pitch black. When playing as a defense team, which are basically the insurgents, you don't have access to night vision like the attackers have, so you're going to have to rely on flashlights or getting over your irrational fear of the dark because we all know flashlights just give away your position. So the start is rough, but after playing it a little while you'll start to get to grips of the map, and pair that with a team who all understand each other, you can get some really good squad based moments. A team much like this one. Go an M4, get your MVGs on, go a nade. I'm ready to rock and rumble. Uh, modify, modify, modify. We're going for lights out, yeah, boys. Copy that. Mm. Copy that. Copy that. We go to this underground bit. Underground right. channel. Sounds good to me, boys. Alright, let's go. Go for lights out, guys. Bomb on the door. I'm gonna clear the room. He was behind the counter. There's a trap on that door right there. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. The door open? The trap. Got it. Good stuff. One down. Room on the right, I'll clear it. Push I'm dead. Where were they? Uh, I don't know. Everything Guy dead, top of the stairwell. Room, room clear. Camera destroyed. He's in the toilet. Down. Down. Fire, 
when we're looking at the map, boys, can you uh, help me draw a willy? There we go. Oh, there it is. That's the willy of champions. Deploying in ten seconds. You legends. Let's go underground tunnel again. You first, Shilby. Up. He ran away. He's reloading to the left. Come out. Moving up. Ah, he's in that side room. That one. Okay. Good shit. <laughs> Sorry, man. No worries. They shut the lights. Come on. on. Got a guy coming down the stairs on the roof, he's dead. Uh, I just took two guys out in the basement parking lot. They were running out. Uh, Where are they, mate? They pinged it. One down. Alright. Cut him. Good shit. Good shit, guys. Game's easy. Easy. <laughs> I picked up one of these guys' M4s. I'm good. Got one down. One is still in there. He's, He's down. down. Guy at the metal detector. Another one right next to you. One bottom, bottom floor, floor, main entrance. Another guy dead. Very slow. They lost a team, mate. That's second floor, I think. All enemies have been neutralized. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't know. Oh, my cock, mate. It fell off and I had to put it back. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. <laughs> He's only got one, he has to make up for it. <laughs> he had a dirty corner pick on me there.